To Be Like Jesus, written by Ellen G. White. O oh, day of rest and gladness, O oh, day of joy and light, O oh, balm of care and sadness, most beautiful, most bright, on thee the high and lowly who bend before the throne. Sing holy, holy, holy to the eternal one. The day that God made holy, May 30th, the Sabbath, not Jewish, but Christ's holy day. So he came to Nazareth where he had been brought up, and as his custom was, he went into the synagogue on the Sabbath day and stood up to read. Luke 4 verse 16 How can we account for the observance of the first day of the week by the majority of professed Christians when the Bible presents no authority for this change either in the precept or in the example of Christ or his followers? We can account for it in the fact that the world has followed the traditions of human beings instead of a Thus saith the Lord. This has been the work that Satan has always sought to accomplish. Lead people away from the commandments of God to the veneration and obedience of the traditions of the world. Through human instrumentalities, he has cast contempt upon the Sabbath of Jehovah and has stigmatized it as the old Jewish Sabbath. Thousands have thoughtlessly echoed this reproach as thought it were something to which was attached great weight of argument. But they have lost sight of the fact that the Jewish people were especially chosen of God as the guardians of his truth, the keepers of his law, the depositary of his sacred oracles. They received the lively oracles to give unto us. The Old and New Testaments both came through the Jews to us. Every promise in the Bible, every ray of light which has shone upon us from the word of God has come through the Jewish nation. Christ was the leader of the Hebrews as they marched from Egypt to Canaan. In union with the Father, Christ proclaimed the law amid the thunders of Sinai to the Jews. And when he appeared on earth as a man, he came as a descendant of Abraham. Shall we use the same argument concerning the Bible and the Christ, and reject them as Jewish, as is done in rejecting the Sabbath of the Lord our God? The Sabbath institution is as closely identified with the Jews as in the Bible. The Sabbath institution is as closely identified with the Jews as is the Bible. And there is the same reason for the rejection of one as of the other. But the Sabbath is not Jewish in its origin. It was instituted in Eden before there were such a people known as the Jews. The Sabbath was made for all humanity and was instituted in Eden before the fall of Adam and Eve. The Creator called it my holy day. Christ announced himself as the Lord of the Sabbath. Beginning with creation, it is as old as the human race and having been made for human beings, it will exist as long as they shall exist. A day of sweet reflection, thou art a day of love, a day to raise affection. From earth to things above, new grace is ever gaining from this our day of rest. We seek the rest remaining in mansions of the blessed. Join us tomorrow for another devotional reading by God's grace. The Lord your God will set you 
high above all nations of the earth. You will experience all these blessings if you obey the Lord your God. 